It's been four days since Kyle Britton was last seen on the Big Island. The 27-year-old left to go hiking in Waipio Valley on August 30th and has since been missing. Jen Boniza has the latest on the search. Jen? Joe's search efforts continued by both land and air today. Though there has been no sign of Britain by rescuers so far, his family is not giving up hope. Kyle Britton has been missing since Friday. Now four days into the search, his mother, Melinda Gaborno, says she is focusing on staying positive. It's been difficult, um, but I, I have confidence in my son's ability to survive. Gaborno spoke to her son before he left to hike the zigzag trail leading from Waipio Valley to Waimanu Valley. She says he's an avid hiker and often hikes with his father and brothers. This is the first time that Kyle has ever uh, hiked a trail by himself. And um, despite warnings by family, his dad and I and his brothers. Except for Britain's car, which was found parked near the Waipio Valley lookout, rescue efforts have been unsuccessful. The people they have interviewed over the weekend that have been down there have not seen him at all. Okinaka says county rescue teams are searching by air and by land, paying close attention to areas near ridges and cliffs. Two canines are being utilized, and Chris Berquist, who helped find Amanda Eller, is now involved with the search. He's been in close contact with our incident commander there on scene. And their coordinated efforts to search together. That way, we don't have any duplication of effort while searching. And we have accountability for everybody that's down there, you know, assisting with the search. There were roughly 22 people on the ground involved in the search today. Hawaii County will assist through tomorrow. Their protocol allows them to help search and rescue efforts for five days. Cal Britton's family has already set up a GoFundMe to help cover the cost of search efforts after tomorrow. You can log on to kh12.com for more information. Back to the desk.